What is up YouTube? It's your girl Kylie coming back at you with another video today. So for last week's video, I did something really interesting. I thought it would be cool to let y'all pick which video I filmed every week. So I did a poll on my Instagram story and an overwhelming amount of people wanted me to film my skincare video. Like 78% of y'all wanted me to. So I was like, you know what? I'm not even gonna do a finalist poll. I'm just gonna go ahead and film my skincare video. Now what I'm gonna do first is first of all, take off this really uncomfortable blazer. It's cute and all, but man, I can't even move my arms. And then I'm gonna put my hair up, take my earrings and glasses off, and put my pajamas on. So before I get started with my skincare routine, I just wanna mention this one app that I use that's really cool. This video is not sponsored at all, but it's called Think Dirty. So what it does is whenever you are shopping for any makeup products or skincare products, you'll look them up on this app and it'll list all of the ingredients found in that certain product. And it'll rate them on a scale of clean to dirty. Clean being a green ingredient and dirty being a red ingredient. It also tells you what it's normally used for. It will tell you all of the ingredients used in that product as well as the usage for it any health impacts it has in an explanation of that product so I just wanted to mention that really cool app go download it not sponsored I just think it's super cool so my first step in my skincare routine is my Clinique take the day off balm this retails for $30 and you can get it at Dillard's or anywhere like that that's you can get it at Dillard's or Sephora I I need to wash my hands that's disgusting since I have nails I don't want to scrape into it because it'll like get all crusty and under my nails so I just kind of bend my finger like this and take a little bit kind of like this much and then I will just put it oh Put it on my face and scrub it in. Oh, I also need to take off my eyelashes. Hold on. Uh, oh, that's such a satisfying feeling. Woo! So I will just go in and rub it into my face. And a little bit of this goes a long way. And mostly the reason that I use this is it gets the majority of my makeup off. So the rest of my skincare routine is just cleansing my skin and not cleaning the makeup off of my face. My main usage for this is so I save my facial cleansing products because they are a little bit more on the pricier side and I don't wanna go through those quickly. I wanna kind of elongate those as long as I can. And this whole tub normally lasts me about three weeks to a month and that's just me because I do wear a lot of makeup. So for those of you who don't wear as much makeup, it can probably last you up to two to three months. So you really get your money's worth of it. And a really cool ingredient in this, and I found this on Think Dirt is vitamin E oil and coconut oil. So coconut oil actually helps you get your makeup off, but I wouldn't use the actual thing because that will clog your pores because a little bit of it is okay. But if you use like straight coconut oil on your face, that will clog your pores. And it also has vitamin E oil, which is an anti-aging oil. So any skincare that you use that says it's vitamin E oil, and it's anti-aging, that's why. So now I'm gonna go wash this off on my face. Now that I have that washed off, I'm gonna go in with my AHA BHA. I call it my Aha Baja Exfoliating Cleanser. This retails for $47. I get mine off Amazon. And it's really cool because Skin Medica is actually a dermatologist recommended brand. And this facial cleanser works really well for me because I know you're only supposed to exfoliate only a couple times a week, but my skin works really good with exfoliators just because every day I like to get all of my dead skin and makeup off of my face. And also too, it's not a very harsh exfoliator, it's very gentle. If you do get the face wash, you will see that the little exfoliating beads in it are very small. I would say they're probably half the size of the clean and clear exfoliating scrub. So yeah, very gentle. Now I'm gonna go wash this off. Also too, if you're looking for a very good facial cleanser and you're willing to splurge the money to clear your acne, out of every product that I use in this video, I highly recommend this one. Using this every morning and night has truly cleared my face up. I used to have really bad acne and just this gentle exfoliator really helped me. So I know it's a little pricey, but it's totally worth it. And everything also will be linked in the description down below. So if you wanna go and purchase any of these products, just click the link to whatever you like. 
My next step in my skincare routine is I go in with the Skin Medica Purifying Foaming Wash. So the Purifying Foaming Wash has salicylic acid in it, and this is an ingredient used to dry out the oils on your skin. So if you have dry skin, I don't recommend this. I recommend the exfoliating cleanser, but if you have oily skin like me, this is a very nice face product to use. Now it's not an exfoliator, it's actually a foam wash. I just use two pumps of it. Oh, and also too, all of these products, a little bit goes a long way. So like, I know the price is kind of up there, but I mean, the, all of this stuff literally lasts me almost two to three months. And I'll be honest with you, I slip up a couple times and I'll just use my exfoliating wash. I'm just gonna really massage that into my pores and on my forehead. I also try to kind of get it up in the hairline because product still goes up there like whenever I am putting on my makeup. And this retails for $44. Now that we have the makeup off, pores cleaned, we're gonna do one last cleansing step. This is my Rejuvenating Toner by Skin Medica. So what I do is I just go in with uh, some cotton balls and I will just kind of spray the toner generously onto the cotton balls and then on my face like setting spray. And what this will do is any of that excess product, it will just pick it up and wipe it away as well as tone your face. Because Skin Medica is a very good anti-aging brand. I will mostly focus this toner on my T-zone because that is where I have the most dirt throughout the day collect. And then again, I will kind of go up into my hairline with it, get any of that makeup off of my face. And I also too have very sensitive skin like I'll try to get brave and try new skincare products and literally the next day my skin will break out and then I'm just back to my skincare routine so I have definitely used these products for a long time and it's what works for me now that I have everything cleansed my toner is on I go in with my moisturizer which is the skin medica dermal repair cream this retails at $129 and I know that is so far up there for a moisturizer y'all but literally life changing the reason that it is that high up on the price is because it is a very good anti-aging moisturizer so for any of y'all who have a little bit of wrinkles coming through this moisturizer will save your life and it is also so moisturizing like literally I will sometimes I'll be bad and I'll forget to moisturize you should always moisturize it helps your skin stay rejuvenated and plump but i'll forget to moisturize some days and i'll wake up and i'll look like a lizard and have cracks on my face and i will put this on it'll just get rid of them literally in less than 24 hours this step is optional i just like to include it too is the tns eye repair by skin medica this retails for 102 dollars and then again you use a very small amount y'all like th this product can last you such a long time and its effects are like unbelievable i just whenever i use this i will wake up and i will just feel so rejuvenated and moisturized and like i literally just got botox injected into my face but i didn't i just put a really good moisturizer on this kind of helps with deep puffing and then any eye wrinkles i know i'm only 18 but i still have a little bit of eye wrinkles coming under my face and that is all thanks to homework and online classes lastly is my epiduo i don't know how much this retails for because i got it at the dermatologist it's just a part of my skincare routine this really isn't something that you can buy online i think you have to go through a dermatologist and get it but it's the last step in my skincare routine and what i will do is with the tiniest amount y'all because this has so much out of phthalene and benzenol peroxide that it will dry out your skin if you don't use it with a moisturizer and by itself y'all it is very strong but you know what it does the trick and so what i will do is I will just with the tiniest amount just kind of put it on my face where I have acne so I'll dot it but like you don't need a lot like if you think that oh I'm just gonna like go and put this on my face I promise you will look like concrete the next day because your skin will be so dry so that concludes my skincare routine thank y'all so much for watching also thank y'all so much for everybody who has been showing love and support for any of these products if you want to buy them they're going to be linked in the description box 
I always get mine off Amazon because it comes in quick. Make sure y'all also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and my Pinterest to get caught up on when I post videos and just with my everyday life. And you will also get a say in what videos I post each week on my story. That's where I'm mostly active at and you'll always be notified whenever my videos go up. I will say I'm very proud of my Pinterest boards. So if y'all wanna go check me out over there, y'all can. And until then, stay groovy. Skin fresh, now I'm gonna go eat some pizza, pizza.